Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay from Me, Him, The Dog and a Baby. Today I'm going to be showing you around our Redwood Tower Playhouse from Big Game Hunters, which you can see in the background there. So here we go, I'm going to show you a little tour. So there you can see the whole thing built as one. It took us roughly three and a half, four hours to put together and there was three of us doing that. The instructions were a little bit misleading at times, but um, I've been told that we may have got an old version of the instructions, so hopefully the new ones are a little bit easier to follow. So this is aimed at children three plus. Now Erin is only two and a half, um, but she's more than capable of climbing the steps and everything herself, so we didn't really see it as a problem. It's got some great little features, like you can see the slide there, and then it's got steps the other side. Now these are interchangeable, so you, it doesn't matter which way you put them on, you can have it either way. So we walk up, I'll show you, because they're just screwed in, so it means that you can pick which way round you want them. I think it really depends on what setup your garden has and how much space you have um, and it just seemed to work a little bit better for us this way round. So as you can see it's got a bit of a crooked look to it which I think just adds to the charm um, and it makes it really suitable for children. The door's wonky, you can see up there there is, I'll zoom in, There is the crooked chimney as well. The front bit, the rail is slanty, but I think it's really, really cute, which is why we picked this one. Um, the tower playhouse comes with one round window on one side, which doesn't open. The front door and that bit there at the top. And then at the side, it's got the green window which does open. Now it comes with handles as you can see on both sides and they close on a magnet. So there's your window and same thing for your door. Opens with the handle and closes on a magnet. Now you can see inside there is quite a lot of space Erin's already got some soft toys in there, look, we've got a bunny and a chicken. Um, now what I will say is we do want to get something to put in here, we're trying to look for a tiny little table, but you can also really customise it as well if you want to. Um, we're planning on getting some of those um, things that you put picture frames up with that don't mark anything, so you can just sort of stick them to the wall and then Erin can have some pictures up in there and maybe a big cushion. So the steps, as I said before, uh, they're non-slip steps because of the way they're designed. We've also got the Big Game Hunters logo at the top. And take you for a little walk around the back. There's the round window again. And the chimney. And we've left quite a bit of space at the back there. So Erin's had this for nearly a month now and she comes out to play in it every single time we come out in the garden. She loves taking new toys in there. She loves having a run up the steps and sort of peeking her head out the doors and the windows. And I think it's a really great um, addition to our garden for her. As you can see, we do have other toys out here as well. Um, and what I do like about this tower playhouse is that it's got storage underneath so we've utilised that to put some of her into toys that she maybe doesn't play with quite so often I'll just take you for another look inside from the window Now Big Game Hunters do have different playhouses to buy and they come in varying sizes and styles. There are some that sit on the floor and like this one. Um, there are bigger ones, there is a lot of choice. 
Um, and Erin really loves her playhouse, so I'm really, really glad we got it for her. Um, I do think this one's maybe not quite as suited to older children just because of the size inside. I think Erin will um, maybe grow out of it by 10 or so, if not before. But um, as we've bought it early for her, with her being just two and a half, I think she's going to get a lot of use out of this. So, um, as I said before, the instruction wasn't as good as it could have been and it could have been a little bit easier to put together um, but otherwise it's great great value for money and it is a, a really nice playhouse and Erin loves playing with it so thanks for watching bye